What's up YouTube? It's Monzingo. Um and I'm going to be doing the mage tower today on the fire mage and <coughs> getting the artifact appearance you see here. And I'm going to show you how I did it. Um the talents I chose was fire starter, shimmer for the extra healing from blink, um mirror images is just really good Rune, rune of power would probably be the like the better one to take if you didn't have to stand still because that's a lot of damage 40 percent is a lot of damage but i went with mirror images because you're always moving you're constantly moving having to move so so i didn't think that rune of power was very good if you do have the fire headpiece legendary uh then alex Straza's fury is probably better than flame on but i didn't have it so i used flame on it worked just fine uh, Ring of Frost, um, just so you can root the ads if you need to. I didn't ever really need to, but if you not able to down them as fast as I did, Ring of Frost them, and you can stop them that way. Living Bomb, it really helps take out all the ads that she calls out. It'll when you put it on one target, it'll explode. It'll spread to everybody else, and then they'll explode. It's really good for AOE damage, and so is Meteor. Meteor is huge for AOE damage. Now, the next thing I'm going to show you on my gear is a little bit harder to obtain. Uh, I got a really good good one. If you can get this trinket, it will make the Mage Tower super easy. And that trinket is the Prototype's Personal Decapitator. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But it makes this fight super easy though i got a titan forge 950 so i got really really lucky on it this trinket does so much aoe damage and on this fight it's a big aoe fight so if you can get your hands on this trinket it will make this thing a breeze the other legendary like i said that would be really good would be the helmet Increased dragon breath damage by 100% and range by 25 yards. That is a huge headpiece. I don't have it. Wish I did, but um, I used the bracers. Never really used the proc. Didn't have time to stop and cast that big thing. But I think I, maybe I did once. I believe. Um, as far as legendaries go, the ones you'd probably really want to shoot for is pride as and then the headpiece because pride as is going to give you that big shield. Just so you you pretty much if you get pride as in that headpiece you're pretty much just gonna beat this thing like it's nothing. I didn't have either one of them, but I did have this trinket and this trinket I think's what really just pushed it over the top for me and let me take out all the ads uh, quicker than the fight really intends it to be. Um, but all right, uh, now I'm gonna show you the fight. Um, in the fight there's two ads that get called out from behind me you need to kill those ASAP those are healing ads make sure you take those down immediately and also there's a uber ad that you have to take out if she has her shield up otherwise the shield won't break and you'll see me even dip low in life a few times because trying to get that ad down before I can bust the shield because I was actually DPSing her higher so she was like calling ads out faster than she normally does in like if you're doing less dps but i was doing such high dps that that she was calling the ads out faster so it was actually in some instances having more gear makes it a little harder in some ways but all right let's jump into the fight 